I'm Nicholas Thompson, and this is South by Southwest. We've done a whole lot of great stories at Wired since I started. One that I'm really proud of is a recent story we did on Tesla, the reporter Charles Duhigg got deep inside the company, explaining both the mania and the brilliance of Elon Musk. We did a piece by Gideon Lewis Krauss that I thought was one of the best ways to understand both how blockchain works, and humans, and the emotions behind it. We've done incredible stories about hacking. Personally, the story that I worked on the most that I'm proudest of is a long investigation with my writing partner, Fred Vogelstein, about Facebook and the forces that turned it upside down in 2016 and 2017. I fundamentally believe that the problems with the tech companies they have right now are fixable. But I also think that we do need to look at how we regulate them to try to generate more competition. We do want more competitive marketplaces than we have now. That would be good for America. I use social media relentlessly to try to get people to read Wired stories. My philosophy is there's too much garbage on social media, and so as an individual, I should try to put interesting stories, thoughtful articles, whether they're from Wired, whether they're from The New Yorker, whether they're from other places. So I try to put good information on social media. My privacy policy is that I turn off all notifications, I turn off all tracking settings, I try to minimize the amount of information that's collected about me, and then I never, ever put pictures of my children up. I hope to see a future where technology is developed in a way that enriches our imagination, helps democracy, helps, soci helps liberal society function. My greatest fear is that the world is moving in a direction that's a little more authoritarian, a little more closed, and that these technologies that should bring people together, that should create wealth and opportunity, have had a tendency in recent times to drive people apart and to make democracy function less well. And I think that's worrisome, but it could go the other way. My kids are about to start using technology. They're 10, 8, and 5. It's so much fun to watch the way they view things, to see their comfort level with voice technology, to see their profound skepticism of social media, to see their excitement about robotics, but their distrust of the tech industry in general. They're coming of age at a really interesting moment where it's a moment both of profound invention and profound skepticism of the intents of the inventors. And so watching them go through that and helping them go through that is going to be fun. I am Lauren Mayberry. I'm Chang'e. I'm Dan Rather. I'm Amber Ruffin, and this is South by Southwest.